Hello everyone, this is Richard from Modern Health Fund. Recently, news was published that the US military is testing an anti-aging pill and will conduct clinical trials next year. Interestingly, the small molecule that they are using was developed by Metro Biotech, a company co-founded by Dr. David Sinclair. And exclusively focused on developing NAD precursors. First a disclaimer that we are sharing some news that we found interesting. It is not a recommendation or medical advice. Let's have a look at what we found. Here is the article, SOCOM to test anti-aging pill next year, where SOCOM is Special Operations Command, a joint command for all the special operations services in the US military. In the article they say that SOCOM will start a clinical trial next year of a pill which may inhibit or reduce some of the effects of aging and injury, part of a larger Pentagon push for improved human performance. According to Lisa Sanders, Director of Science and Technology for Special Operations Forces, if it is truly successful at delaying aging and preventing onset of injury, it will be a game changer. And they have completed the preclinical trials on safety and dosing and will start the performance testing in 2022, according to Navy Commander Tim Hawkins, a SOCOM spokesperson. SOCOM is partnering with Metro International Biotech for the development of the pill and will base it on a human performance small molecule. SOCOM has already spent 2.8 million in this effort, showing a commitment to the program. So a small molecule is a low molecular weight organic compound, many of which regulate biological processes and often form the basis of drugs. The potential benefits of small molecules is that they can cross cell membranes and can be designed to engage specific targets. A nutraceutical is a health-giving additive, essentially a dietary supplement, which is available without a prescription. Commander Hawkins makes clear that this is not about creating physical traits that don't already exist, but for improving the performance of existing characteristics, which naturally decline with age. He continues that they are aiming for a nutraceutical and that the pill could have both military and civilian uses, such as increased performance and faster recovery. SOCOM said they were working with Metro International Biotech to develop this pill. For those who are following us, we did a video on this company and their lead molecule, MIB626, before. It's called Metro Biotech and uh, it makes super NAD boosters and the drug is called, developmental drug is MIB-626. It often comes as a shock um, to people who don't work on this that we're already testing these molecules in clinical trials on elderly people. Uh, we've been doing that for a number of years now uh, with some positive results. Although the nature of the small molecule that SOCOM are developing is not mentioned in the article, given Metro Biotech's sole focus on NAD precursor, it looks like it would be such a molecule. Dr. Sinclair is a co-founder and the chairman of the Scientific Advisory Board at Metro Biotech. The company shows that their mission is to enable longer, healthier lives, specifically through NAD plus cellular protection mechanisms. On their website, they claim to be manufacturing a naturally occurring human clinical grade NAD plus enhancer, to have also designed and synthesized over a hundred other NAD plus enhancers, collected preclinical data on the therapeutic effects of modulating NAD and developed MIB-626, an NAD booster with scalable manufacturing capabilities. MIB-626 is already in phase two clinical trials. The reason I think this is really exciting is the US military is convinced enough of the effects of NAD boosters to start testing them. Hopefully this will speed up the trial process and we will see results soon. It's also encouraging that they're calling the pill a nutraceutical which should be available over the counter rather than requiring a prescription. And of course, great to see that they are working with Dr. David Sinclair's company. We will update you when we hear any new information on this exciting topic. I hope that you found the video informative. Please do hit the thumbs up button, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell button for any new video release notifications. Thank you so much for your kind support. I wish you all well and we'll speak to you again soon.